found somebody, I say you don't cross my mind. And she doesn't know that your favorite place is still mine. Now I take the long way home, avoid what I can let. Hello you guys and welcome to today's vlog. So we have lots to do today. Today is going to be like the craziest day. So I did wake up really early, which I was super happy about. I got my workout in, I showered, I ate, I got ready. Even though I'm on like, my hair's not looking too good today. I'm on day five hair, but I get my hair done today. I think I'm gonna cut couple inches off but because I get my hair done today I never wash my hair before it because she washes my hair for me so I'm like okay gotta make it at least look good for now but I got ready and then right now I'm debating to run to Starbucks because I have a couple minutes or to make coffee myself which I should do I literally haven't been getting coffee as much as I used to like I used to get coffee daily but now I get it like once a week and I'll run to like Starbucks or whatever once a week but I'm debating to like run and grab one because today I actually before my hair appointment I have an interview I need to do so I'm going to be interviewing someone for my other channel so I have a couple minutes I may run may not but yeah today's just a busy day we got interviews we got editing we got applying for jobs we have going back and forth with the college I graduated from then we have the hair appointment that's like 40 minutes away so yeah I'm excited I definitely think I'm gonna cut a couple inches of my hair and then I'm going to get some layers because I got my hair cut six months ago but all of the layers are pretty much like can't notice it my hair looks all one layer so we're gonna get that fixed today. So here's your reminder to go get your hair cut You should be getting it cut and trimmed every couple months But I wait every six months since I have long hair. But anyways, that's what we're up to today. Lots to do Oh my gosh, you guys I was literally in the middle of talking to you and then I forgot I didn't have my microphone in So I just put my microphone in sorry if the first minute and a half was not the best audio But anyways, what I was saying was the temp here in Texas has been kind of crazy lately It's been going down to like 40 degrees with like high winds that are freezing so today is actually in the 70s and tomorrow's gonna be in the 70s and then it's gonna drop again so I'm gonna take advantage of that that's why I want to get coffee I feel like I don't know if you guys are like that too but with me whenever it's like a warmer day out and the sun's out I just try and make the excuse to leave the house as much as possible uh, because I pretty much work from home as of right now while I'm looking for some jobs and applying to some but anyways that's what we're up to I'm gonna go get a coffee yeah I've, I've been trying to convince myself in my head not to but let's go get a coffee come back do the interview and then get ready to go get the haircut Okay, y'all, I've got my coffee. But anyways, my Home Chef box came today. So I guess I'll show you guys. I haven't told you guys in a long time, but Home Chef, we, Home Chef, Home Chef, we order pretty much weekly. I normally do two to three meals, but this week I did four just because I did not have that much stuff in the house. So it's kind of like this meal delivery service. I'm not like sponsored or anything, but it's just a meal delivery service that we get for dinners, but you could use them for lunches and everything like that. They're also starting to get a lot more stuff like desserts, breakfast items. So it seems like they're trying to expand on the stuff that they have for you to pick from. So I'll unbox that. And then I gotta go do that quick interview that should give me enough time to eat and then Get to my hair appointment. Okay, I literally have you guys in my cabinet. Our countertops are so low, <laughs> so I always have to put you guys up here. But yeah, Home Chef they gave us our little recipes. So I guess we got a chicken and like broccoli meal, then stuffed peppers. But I never actually stuff the peppers. I just cut them up and use them, and then make a bowl with like rice and stuff. And then another, oh no, no a pork chop meal, and then a little steak meal, which I'm very excited for. And then Home Chef pretty much packages your items like in separate bags. So all you have to do is grab the bag, grab the meat, grab the recipe, and then you're like ready to cook with all your ingredients. So yeah, nothing special, but this is what it looks like. So it has like your little meal and what it is, and then has all the ingredients for you to cook it. And then you just grab like the meat that you have frozen. So yeah, I love snagging this because it's definitely helpful for us when we don't know what to cook. Okay, you guys, so I am now going to get ready for the interview, do the interview, respond to YouTube comments from today's video because I uploaded it today, which I normally don't, but it was like a part two video to another video. And then I need to make an Instagram reel. That's what we gotta do, we got this. <laughs>
Okay, you guys, it is hot as heck out, but anyways, I just got to my hair appointment. As of right now, my hair is literally so long. It's all the way back down to my booty, so I think I'm gonna ask her to cut off a few inches. Also, the lighting was terrible right there, but I think I'm gonna tell her to cut off as much as I have dead on the, my ends, and then probably do some long layers. I normally don't like to do many layers because I find it annoying when I wanna put my hair in like a bun in the mornings or in a ponytail and then I can't do it how I want to do it because the layers are too short so definitely gonna ask her to do long layers so she just look, kind of like layers the bottom and doesn't really layer up here I got that back in July and I really liked it but back in July I cut off nine inches or eight something like that so I cut off a lot more I have a couple minutes until I have to go in I also have to go to the bathroom so bad and I'm not excited for on the way home how bad traffic is gonna be it is currently 250 so by the time I'm done with my hair it'll probably be like 4 30 ish and then that's literally when rush hour starts and my hair is right by or my hair um stylist is right by like a college where people are probably getting out of school and stuff like that are out of class so it's gonna be a crazy ride back but i'll show you guys my hair when i'm done i also normally have her style it wavy because i never wave my hair i used to wave my hair a lot more like years ago but for some reason i just i've gotten lazy <laughs> with styling my hair when i literally don't go anywhere for college anymore and I literally work at home as of right now. Uh, I feel like when I was going to college, like night class and stuff like that, I would do my hair a lot more often, but I just straighten it like once a week and then just like keep it straight. Let's go get the hair done. Okay, you guys, the cut is done. This is horror. I mean, this is actually great lighting when the sun's right in front of me, but I feel like it's horrible lighting for the viewfinder, but cut is done. She did take a couple inches. I'll just step outside. That's why I parked right here, but I got a couple inches off and then I had her wave it and I love it. I feel like it looks so good and then it gives me like more dimension and I definitely look like a weirdo because a car is driving by and they're probably like this hoe is talking to herself but I pretty much told her girl cut away cut all of the dead ends off anything you need to cut off cut it off I love it it is now holy crap whoa we got done early that's good I need to get on the road yeah it's gonna take me I'll be home at 4 51 so should be good enough time wise okay you guys so I am home one changed my shirt had Christian take a couple photos of me outside so I could post on Instagram um but yeah this is the cut I really do love it and I just love it waved because I never take the time to wave my own hair but earlier it was like down to I would say here so we definitely got a couple inches but it is waved so it'll be longer when it's straightened and then I love how she did the long layers so we have like shorter pieces up here and then longer pieces here so it goes that short when it comes to the layers and then the longer pieces are that long. I feel fresh. I feel like with a haircut, I always, I don't know, I just feel really fresh and good. So it sucks that I got my hair cut so late in the day that it's like the day's wasted. I can't even go strut my stuff. Can't even go. And when I mean strut my stuff, I mean literally walking into a grocery store. <laughs> I can't do anything because it's already nighttime and then these will probably fall. My hair doesn't hold curls very well. So it will probably fall by tomorrow. It is what it is. It is 5.30. So I do need to get some more work done before I am done with work for the end of the night. So I am going to literally take the footage off my camera that I filmed today and edit today's vlog or start to edit it clearly we're not done with the vlog but i'm going to start editing it and then i need to um, prep some content for next week that i need to upload and then i am going to apply to some jobs so i have been applying to some jobs lately but my school has been helping me like fix my resume for each job position and there's this job position that i really really want to apply for right now before it closes even though the the thing doesn't say when it closes like the job listing so that kind of sucks but i'm trying to wait for my school to respond to me about my resume before I send it to these people because they're like really important people like kind of working for the city <laughs> so I want to make sure my resume is good enough but if they don't answer me by tomorrow I'm gonna just need to send it that's what I'm gonna do that is what I'm up to if you guys have any resume tips any interview tips let a girl know I'm listening to all people lately <laughs> on all the tips that they have so that's what we're gonna do Okay, you guys, so I am officially tapped out for the day. I don't know what it is, but today I just <laughs> felt really tired. I think I just crashed after my haircut and after I got home, my like energy levels went 
into the ground. So all I did just now was fully edit today's vlog. It's about 7.30, so I'm going to be clocking out for tonight. So I'm just going to finish editing this one clip, download this video, and then post it and schedule it so that it could go up tomorrow morning. Because I love uploading at 11 a.m. Central Time. It's like my favorite time to get a video up. It keeps me in like a really good routine. So that's what I'm gonna do. So I'm gonna go do that, cook dinner. We're actually gonna have one of the home chef meals tonight because it's just super easy. So I think the one we're we're doing is the one that said it was supposed to be like stuffed peppers so i normally fill like bell peppers i don't fill the jalapeno peppers so i'm just going to not do that i'm gonna like make it and then i'll just put it in a bowl with rice so it'll be like a rice bowl me and christian love rice bowls whenever something says i need to like stuff a pepper i never stuff peppers anymore i literally just take it i cook it how it says and then i put it on a bowl of minute rice because i don't even have time to cook rice rice is hard to cook it is not an easy thing to cook but anyways now i'm gonna start ranting so i hope you guys had an amazing wednesday or an amazing day whenever you're watching this definitely make sure to comment down below how was your day today i'd love to know don't forget to leave a like and a comment and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already i upload every single wednesday and i will see you guys next week